Hello, my name is Joseph Koningsmark, and I'm going to be showing you how to make an origami claw. And real quick, um, the Japanese actually gave origami figures to each other and to their friends and family to, and if they um, seen it in their or like if they seen it in their house. Um, a week or so later, that meant that they kept it safe and that they were, um, that they were trustworthy. And, yeah. So, real quick, and we're gonna get started. So, first, take the bottom left corner, um, of your paper. And fold that up to the right side of your paper. Like that. Just gonna, and make sure that this lines up like that. So it's at a point, and then flatten that out. So it should look look like that, kind of like a triangle and a rectangle. And you gotta take the tip of the triangle, flip it up to the bottom left corner of the rectangle. Make sure the bottom is bottom corner of the triangle is sharp. Okay, so it should like that, look like that. So we have a triangle and a rectangle. Take the top two corners of the rectangle, fold them down along like that. Make sure there's just a little bit of space between so it won't like fold onto it and then crease over or something. Just make sure there's space so when you fold it over it's not it does doesn't so we're gonna have two folds like that. And fold the entire top over. So you have one triangle. There's no folds or anything on the back. On the front there's just this little flap. And then you're going to crease the triangle in half. Crease the triangle in half. Don't fold it. Just crease, uncrease. And then take this, the left side, the triangle, and match it to the left side. Or not to the left side, to the middle of the triangle. So it looks like that. And then take this half of the triangle, wrap it around. Make sure make sure that that this isn't above this line by a lot, because if it is then it'll mess up the flap. So make sure that is sharp. This is going to be the tip of the claw. And then just fold this over. Just kind of bend this around a little bit. So, so it can bend easier. And this flap right here. Stuff that into the flap. So like that. And then there are three slits of paper. You're going to stick your finger in the far right of the two slits. Just kind of move it around a little bit. Get your finger comfortable in there. And there you go.